Hey, what's up gamers? It's AJ again from 1212 Games with another unboxing video for you. And in today's video, we're going to be unboxing Splatterhouse 3 Extra Bloody Edition for the Sega Genesis. Alrighty. So looking at the front, you've got the title, Splatterhouse 3 Extra Bloody Edition. As with a few other Genesis unboxings I've done recently on this channel, this Extra Bloody Edition is not an original release, but is in fact a slightly modified version of the 1993 original that was released somewhat recently courtesy of Toy Source Games. Other than that little extra subtitle though, I believe uh, the box is basically identical to the original Splatterhouse 3 release, right down to the cover art which, as you can see, features the protagonist, Rick, wielding an axe and battling with this giant, creepy-looking monster. Uh, up at the top, you do have the publisher logo for Namco. Over to the left, you've got the Genesis logo on the familiar-looking diagonal red stripes that Sega used quite extensively uh, during the later years of the Sega Genesis. Down here in the bottom left, you have the official Sega Seal of Quality. And then down here in the bottom right, you have the VRC rating, which in this case was MA13 for mature audiences, 13 and up. It does say parental discretion is advised. And then in addition, there's a little warning above that that says, this game contains scenes depicting graphic violence which may not be suitable for younger players. And then I'll flip it over to the spine and you can see the title again, along with the Genesis and Namco logos on those same diagonal red stripes. And then I'll flip to the top and please note the hang tag, which was typical of Genesis hard box copies. And then I'll flip to the other side and as you can see, there is a Toy Saurus logo sticker seal. And then I'll flip to the bottom. And then looking at the back, it says, he's back. 16 megs of terror, multiple endings, non-linear gameplay, nasty new weapons, password support, and cool digitized graphics. And then you've got some Pretty awesome looking screenshots there, each with its own caption, and those read, Get a grip, give Rick a hand, it's a knockout, aim high, power lifting, you've got to have guts, stretch your limits, and the cutting edge. And then if you look down here towards the bottom left, you can see that this game is single player. And then right above that, you do have a credit for this bloody edition of the game. It says Bloody Edition Hack by CRT Rex, October 2021. Okay, let's go ahead and unbox this. Awesome. So just like the Splatterhouse 2 re-release from Toy Soros Games, uh, Splatterhouse 3 also features a cartridge with a red splattered clear plastic shell, which looks very awesome. And again, this cartridge also has the Sega logo, as well as some patent and caution information on the back just as most standard Genesis cartridges did. I don't know if you can see it, but it is there. And then it's also got the standard indentation there. And then there is the sticker label, which as you can see, looks basically identical to the cover of the box. And it even has the Splatterhouse 3 Extra Bloody Edition titling, both on the front and the top. That's very cool.
And then, last but not least, we do have a nice looking manual, which no Genesis game would be complete without. This one I'm assuming is nearly identical to the original Splatterhouse 3 manual. Um, but there's the front, which again looks basically identical to the cover. And it does include the Splatterhouse 3 Extra Bloody Edition titling. And then inside, you've got some cartridge care information and an epilepsy warning. And then you do have a prologue. And then a table of contents. And an introduction. Starting up your system. Jump start. Taking control. Continued. Mutant Rick. Game screen. Options. Password. Weapons. Hints and some limited warranty information. And that'll do it. Hey, so I'd just like to thank you for checking out this unboxing of Splatterhouse 3 Extra Bloody Edition for the Sega Genesis. If you enjoyed the video, please feel free to like, comment, and or subscribe. And you can also check out our website at 12-12games.com, which you can find down in the description. Till the next time.